guys, your boy Sick Me, sitting here chilling real quick with the man. It's still around one more, roaming around. But anyways, I'm talking about faith and planning and how, like, it's not going against faith. It's just, you know, talking to faith and, you know, how, how faith is personally working in my life, you know. And, like, like I was saying, like, it's okay to plan life. Like, imagine if, if you didn't plan life. And there's a lot of people that plan their life to go to college. And they have faith that they didn't, that the plans come true, you know? You could, that didn't go against faith. So it just depends on the, on the interpretation, you know? Because it just depends on how faith works in your life personally. Like, me personally, like, after being stuck in drugs and life and stuff, the only thing that matters is how it works for me. You know, in my personal relationship and how, like, I came to believe in my faith, you know, and how I came to believe in the things that I believe in, you know, because uh, there were undeniable moments where I was just like, damn, something had to help me there, you know, because I gave up, you know, I knew I gave up and my body gave up on itself. And I was like, something other than myself got me out of there, you know, but that's where it is you know but when it comes to not planning and just faithing life you can do that and live a good life but it's not for everybody you know some people do that and they go and they end up getting a good life but it's not the life they wanted because they didn't know about life and they never lived and then they end up dreading the life the good life that they have and then people say that they're not grateful because of the fact that um you know, they faith through life. They went to church and did whatever, and they got a good life, a good, you know, they did the steps. They did the mechanics of it to, to be successful, but, you know, it wasn't their life because they never planned. And then when they got successful in the life they had, then they realized what their personal goals were, and then they couldn't appreciate the life they had, you know, because it wasn't the life they wanted, you know. So that's the difference between having the life you want to live and living the life that you have. You know, because uh, yeah, you can go to you can go to you can go to meetings, you can go to church, you can go to your gang, you can go to your hood, you can go to your clubhouse, whatever, and you can be whatever they help you become. You know, but if you never truly like find out who you are, you won't truly really live your life. You know, and you won't like your club, your faith, your church, your religion won't be working for you. You would just be like a dead person alive in the church. Do, filling in gaps, you know, basically, you know, but you'd never really be happy. And like for someone to like, if you believe in God, like for someone to die for you to live, that's kind of like a, a waste because you're dead alive. You know what I mean? It, it kind of ruins the sacrifice of like dying for you to be able to exist and sins and shit. You know? So it's crazy. So I don't know. That's just how faith works in my life. It's like if, if like if you were stuck in a canyon, bro, and they pulled you out of the canyon and you were stuck it doesn't matter how the fuck they got you out it just matters that they got you out right so that's how faith in me and my religion stuff is it's like it doesn't matter if it works for you it works for me in this way and that's how it that's how it is and that's you know in the in the church or out the church or a, a church that, that i've never been to it's just the it's all about the message to me so like i plan my life because you know it, it, it feels good to have the stuff you actually want you know because then you're like, then you can appreciate it, then you can be grateful honestly, and then you can be happy with it, like genuinely happy, like genuinely grateful. But anyway, so that's what's going on. Chocolate bananas Tuesdays. So that's a life in a race, what your boy said. I was gonna talk about something else, but I forgot completely. 